guys so over the past few months or since I've done my last hair care routine I've changed up my routine a little bit and I thought it would be really fun to kind of show you what I'm doing now because you know some of my products which a lot of them are centrally the same but I've added a few changed how I'm doing my hair a little bit so I thought it would be fun to share this with you guys so I'll just go ahead and show you first of all my hair is pretty long and I will stand up and show you how long my hair is so my hair goes to right here and um, I haven't cut it since October it gets a little flippy at the end but um, I haven't cut my hair since October and I'm actually going to be getting it trimmed I think um, later on this month so it'll be a little bit shorter in a little while but basically all I do to my hair whereas like damaging things that I could be doing to my hair I um, get highlights which only I get touched up up here I don't really pull them through my entire hair all the time because most of my hair down here is blonde already and then the underneath side of my hair I like to dye um, a couple shades darker than my natural hair color and just dye it brown because my natural hair color is brown and it's not blonde which a lot of people don't realize I'm not actually blonde but I'm not I actually have brown hair so um, yeah this is just like this is kind of faded to almost maybe like a shade or so darker than my natural hair color so these I took out of my shower and they're a little wet I'll go ahead and share them with you what I use for shampoo and conditioner which this really hasn't changed my typical shampoo and conditioner so this is Aussie's moist shampoo and I use this every time I take a shower I've changed up my my shampoos a few times but I just love the way this feels my or makes my hair feel and I haven't really tried anything else if you guys have really good shampoos out there that you think I should try um, let me know because I really like my Aussie shampoo but a lot of people say they don't like it for their hair type but I really like it for mine so my everyday conditioner which I don't like to use just regular conditioners I have to have some form what some form of deep conditioner so this one is the Aussie three minute it's like dripping Aussie three minute miracle which I've used this conditioner since I started YouTube I've always shown this for you guys um, it's my favorite one of my favorite conditioners and um, I love using it and I always recommend it to my friends and they always say they like it after they use it and makes their hair feel super soft and it's helped keep my hair healthy I think and helped me keep my hair growing as long as it has so I really love that conditioner. This one is probably the wettest. This is the Macadamia Natural Oil Deep Repair Mask. And I use this once a week. And some people use it like twice a week. It depends on how often you wash your hair. I probably only wash my hair like a three or four times a week, which might be gross, but it's actually good for your hair not to wash it every day. Um, but if I take, this is gonna be so disgusting and messy. Okay, this is what it looks like in there, and you can see I've used a decent amount of it. Actually, I'm thinking I'm getting down to the bottom. I love the way this smells. I'm absolutely obsessed with how it smells. I used this on my hair today when I took a shower, and literally what I do is, like Mondays or Sundays, just depending, while I'm still at home, I leave this here and I don't travel back and forth with college with this. I always come home on the weekends, and so I usually do that. Um, in my hair when I take a shower on the weekend so I either do it on Sunday or Monday and I'll just do a like whole like full-on deep cleansing of my body I'll do like scrubs and I'll shave my legs which I don't do very often during the winter I'll let that in my hair probably for like 10 minutes I think you're supposed to leave it in for like seven um, but I leave it in for probably like 10 and then I wash it out and it just smells so good and makes my hair feel absolutely amazing and I think it's helped really repair some of the um, bad ends like as you can see my ends you might be able to see I don't know they're really dry right now um, the brown hair is anyways not really the blonde um, they're really really dry and I just need to uh, get them trimmed off because I haven't had a trim since October so I really need to get that done when I get out of the shower the first thing I do is spray a detangler spray in my hair and my phone is going on. So I got, I er, what? I used this Pantene Repair Light Detangler. And I really like this detangler and it lightly conditions as it detangles. And I just spray that pretty much religiously all through my hair. Basically from like my ears down, I spray it out. Depending on what I used for conditioner that day, if I use my um, deep repair mask, I don't have to spray as much. If I use my 3 Minute Miracle, I do have to spray a decent, but it wouldn't be as much as I would if I used like regular conditioner because my hair gets so tangly. And for the longest time, I was using a comb 
to comb out my hair but I've heard so many people talk about this for the longest time and it's a wet brush and it's got some hair in it and I just got this a couple weeks ago and I am absolutely obsessed with it it works so well for getting my um, tangles out of my hair and I can do it so much faster than when I was combing my hair it took forever this takes maybe like five minutes or five minutes that's really long. This takes maybe like two minutes to get my hair brushed out or even a minute. I don't even know. It doesn't take very long. Whereas before, like combing my hair was like five minutes and it was like, ugh, took forever. So I'm obsessed with this wet brush and I got it from Target and they used to only sell it from like Amazon and that's why I never got it because I just never got around to it. But they sell that at Target now and that's where I got it. So definitely go check out the wet brush if you are have like tingly hair like me and you need to like have a quicker way of brushing it out and easier, try the wet brush because it's really awesome. And then I'll throw my hair up in a towel and I know people say that's bad for your hair but honestly I don't care if it's bad for my hair. I have other stuff to go do so I'm gonna put my hair up in a towel. I'm sorry, I don't care. So I put my hair up in a towel and then I take it out and then I rebrush through it with the wet brush because um, I brush my hair before I put it in the towel because then it makes it easier to brush out when I take it out of the towel. And then I use like a lot of this Moroccan hydrating styling cream Moroccan oil brand and you can get this from salons I think I don't really think you can get it from like major like drugstores but you can definitely get it from salons um, I get it from I've got it from a salon in um, the mall where I go to college I get them in my local salons I see it everywhere the Moroccan oil brand is really popular so um, I just use probably like this much in uh, amount in my hand on both sides of my hair and then I put just a little dab and rub it through my hands and then get the ends really good so that I make sure I get my ends hydrated and then I will use like a dime size amount of this Moroccan argan oil from the um, organics line and this is the penetrating oil and I'll just take a dime size amount rub it between both of my hands and then I'll go like this and then I'll go like this and then I take all the rest of it and just like scrunch it on my ends and that seems to work really well on keeping my ends hydrated and like making my hair feel healthy again. So I really like using that product. So that is basically all there is to my routine now. Uh, I mean, I change it up every once in a while when I'm feeling out outrageous. No, that's not the right word. Courageous. Courageous. There we go. When I'm feeling courageous, I'll switch it up a little bit. But for the most part, I stick with my centralized products and I love them. So if you guys want to share with me some of your favorite products, please let me know in the comments down below and I will definitely try to check out some of your favorites. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to subscribe. I put up new videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday and tags on Tuesdays. So thank you guys for watching and I'll talk to you all very soon. Bye guys!